gather this evening in peace, recognizing the things that bind us together in spirit, resting our hopes and dreams of equality on infinite possibility, where there is strength of the many and the power of one. Let us remember those states whose constitutions have enshrined discrimination. Hawaii, Alaska, Nevada, Nebraska, Arkansas, Georgia, Kentucky, Louisiana, Michigan, Mississippi, Missouri, Montana, North Dakota, Ohio, Oklahoma, Utah, Kansas, Texas, Alabama, Colorado, Idaho, South Carolina, South Dakota, Tennessee, Virginia, Wisconsin, Arizona, California, and finally Florida. Please turn to someone that you don't know and share a story in two or three sentences about how the amendment would affect you or a loved one. Or another way to go is why marriage equality is important to you as a person of faith. And then offer that person a word of peace. of what we are doing is inviting millions of Minnesotans to deeply listen to one another and to honestly and authentically tell our stories about our loves, about our religious and spiritual convictions, and about our families. Listening and speaking from our hearts. As a black person in the United Church of Christ, my story of faith is inextricably linked to the story of Sinke and his comrades of the Amistad, whose rallying cry, give us free, served as witness to a God who enters into compassionate solidarity with the oppressed. The issues of poverty, education, suicides, and loss of original family that plague the LGBT community in general are brought forth many times over among their counterparts who are people of color. By politicizing marriage, we move a divine gift away from the human family and into the hands of the electorate. There have been historical attempts to divide the human family against itself, and they are numerous. Just recently, the National Organization for Marriage documents from that organization, they spread money around to vulnerable pastors for the sole purpose of turning black and brown people of faith against each other, because it's not like we do not have LGBT family. But to split us, spread their money around, and in hopes of turning the larger community against itself. But no conspiracy of fear is greater than love. Amen. Amen. Because you all have been through so much, it seems to be a little lag. Well, yes, it is later rather than sooner. But history is a curved line, not a straight line. In fact, it's an arc, and it bends toward justice. Amen. Peace be upon you, brothers and sisters. Amen. Amen.